People often ask us why we're doing what we're doing, and my answer is always very simple. It's to provide for their children the experience we wanted our children to have in college. How do we give the opportunity to lift up a better experience for all students, not just fraternities and sororities, not just military commuters, not athletes, all students? And that's how we came down to this concept of investing in an honors college. We find that ambition is the fuel that gets students where they want to go and our Honors College will get them there farther and faster. My name is Ellis Haar. I'm a proud JU graduate and a product of the JU Honors College and the generosity of the costs. The experiences that I had at JU and at the JU Honors Program changed my entire life. The time that President Koss spent mentoring me changed the way I viewed myself and my capacity and shaped the life that I now live. We're very excited by the leadership that we have established for the Honors College, particularly bringing in our executive director, Dr. Lisa Sutherland. She is an all-star athlete. She brings so much to the table and so much passion and enthusiasm. We were lucky to find her. The Cost Honors College, it is the Cost legacy at Jacksonville University. I'm honored, I'm humbled to be able to lead the transition of the program into the Cost Honors College. Our students want to go out and make a difference in the world. As we think about the Honors College and where we take it in the future is how do we position our honor students to be global leaders? We're going to choose highly motivated, intellectually curious students. We're not seeking all valedictorians and 1600 SATs, although we have some. But what we're seeking is the student who's so motivated to do more, to expand their learning, to drive faster and farther. The goal of what anybody coming here in the future hopefully will experience is a much more kind of customized, almost bespoke experience. Once you get that right, and we will get that right, you then lift that up and you pull it across all 3,000 undergrads and all 1,200 grad students. And that, in our opinion, is how an honors college doesn't help 50 students or 100 students. It helps all students. By doing that, you help the region. I think the reason I'm so deeply invested in our students is the hope they give us. And these students' emphasis on doing better for the world and, and exploiting their talents and going out and saving the world, I believe they will, and I want them to. And to be a small part of that is the greatest gift.